Oh, welcome back, everybody, to a brand new exciting episode of Jacksepticeye's Funniest Old Videos! L is for lovers who love one another. A is for ass, of which I like to eat. U is for your the only one for me. G is for the only gamer I see. I just flew back in from LA and boy are my arms tired. What's on the agenda for today, you ask? Oh, I don't know, maybe some goofs, maybe some gaffs, some memes, some funny videos, and maybe even some. <laughs> I'm not fixing the focus on my camera. Go I don't care. Fuck you, Baltimore! <laughs> Man, this is off to a great start, just straight away! Fuck you, Baltimore! If you're dumb enough to buy a new car this weekend, you're a big enough schmuck to come to Big Bill Hell's car! Bad deal! Cars that break down! Feed! If you <laughs> think you're gonna find a bargain at Big Bill, you can kiss my ass! <laughs> it's our- Wait, 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 wait! Haven't I seen something like this before? I feel like I've seen a video like this before. Have I reacted to it? This is really familiar. I'm having some meme deja vu. If you find a better deal, shove it up your ugly ass. <laughs> that's right. Shove it up your ugly ass. Bring your tray. Bring your title. Bring your wife. We'll fuck her. That's right. We'll <laughs> fuck your wife. Because it's big bill hell. Don't delay. Don't fuck with us or we'll rip your nuts off. Only <laughs> oh, big bill hells. Bring your wife down. We'll fuck her. That's right. We'll fuck your wife. <laughs> Big Bill Hell's car, <laughs> Baltimore's filthiest, and exclusive on one of the meanest sons of bitches in the state of Maryland. Guaranteed! Oh my god, that was wonderful. That was magnificent. Go to hell! Oh, it's, it's frustrating me though, why it's so familiar. I, I mean, I can't really find it. Either I've seen it before, or it's really like something else. It also reminded me of, uh, that, what's that? Drink. It doesn't matter. This one looks funny. Terrible popsicle. No, honey, you'll spoil. <laughs> hey, parents. Tired of those out of control kids throwing embarrassing tantrums wherever they go? At the grocery store, on the playground, Jesus even Christ. at the dinner table. Honestly, that's just me though. That was me as a kid. That's me as, a, as an adult. <laughs> Literally just walking around going, I want taco. <laughs> <laughs> Nap time, the latest, most effective tool for child tantrum prevention. It's simple. Just douse a rag with our patented sleepy time formula, place it over your child's cry hole, press and hold gently for 8 to 12 seconds, and presto, no more tantrum. Okay. <laughs> I don't know if we should show any more of that. Don't do that to your kids. Be nice. You know, I don't know if I should be mad at this. Or are you guys sending me this stuff? Because I laughed at it, and very loudly, so... That's on me. <laughs> Moo goater baiting! Oh, this is just like the Pregananad one. Am I pregnant? Question on how to reach orgasm while mustard baiting. <laughs> orgasm and mustard baiting. <laughs> I bait my mustard every day. <laughs> Oh my god, how can you think of so many different ways to say the same word? I don't even care if these are fake. It's making me like- with. <laughs> Ah. Every teenager's problem. I'm looking for food to unite my penis with. Oh my god, it's so dumb. I had too much master bath. So my penis do a heckin' righty. I also love how the video is just called, Is it wrong to faster bait? Wait, is this the same person who did the other ones? I don't think so, but my god. This is a trip in and of itself. <laughs> the yonkening! This is what I was warning you all about. This is the yonkening in action. That's exactly what it looks like. Hell yeah! <laughs> There's so many of them! It must smell amazing in that house. Are you tired of seeing yourself in the mirror? Oh, yes. Do you look terrible no matter what you do? 
Yes. Yes, you are speaking directly to my heart's problems. Are you gonna cry because you have to show your ugly mug to other people? How do they know? Introducing the Hayam, a revolutionary new product designed to hide <laughs> your ugly mug. I oh my god. Hyum. Anytime I need to hide my horrid face, <laughs> I just put on the Hyum and voila, no more ugly mug. The Hyum brings- You can still have at least your eyes show. Play fun games with your kids like hide that hideous face before I give you away. <laughs> hide that hideous face before I give you away. Man, it's just like being four years old again. I found love with Hyum. Or at least I think I did. Oh my god, that sounded exactly like Dewey from Malcolm in the Middle. I want you to release my brother. Doesn't it? Anyone watch Malcolm in the Middle? Malcolm in the Middle squad. Woo! Go to hell. This is called a banned Ninja Turtle commercial from Germany. What can Ninja Turtles do to get banned? Oh no. Oh no. Stop! 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 I'm sorry? What? What did they say? I have no idea. Are you saying that every time I eat a pickle, I'm eating... A Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle penis? Also, I highly doubt that that was banned in Germany. That just sounds like a clickbait title. Germans are not that easily offended. <laughs> oh, a lot of people sent me this one. It's the Jason Momoa Super Bowl commercial. I don't even know if I'm allowed to show this or if Big Bad Big Brother corporations are going to come down and attack me. I think you've gotten your money already out of this commercial, but it is very, very good. What does home mean to me? It's my sanctuary. He's so awesome. I met it's him. The one place. Oh, I can let my guard down. <laughs> <laughs> now he's all short. So I can just kick back and be totally comfortable in my own skin. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's really Rocket well done. understands that home is where I can be myself. <laughs> and, that, and that feels pretty darn good. That's so weird okay. to look at. Home is where you feel the most really short, and skinny, balding Jason Momoa financing that home with a personalized and convenient Playing experience Psych centered around you. Not only is that a great commercial, because of course everyone's going to be talking about it, but I love that Jason Momoa was like, "Yes, let's do that." That's why he's one of my favorites, because he just seems like he's down for anything. He's just a big dude, and he's just like, "Yeah, fuck it, let's have fun." It's the way I want to live my life. Still working on the big dude part though. Oh boy, I have not yet reacted to any of the flex stuff on this, mainly because I've seen it a million times before actually making this series, so I felt like there was no point showing them in these videos. But flex paste is something that I haven't seen. Premiered February 14, 2020. This just came out. Holy fuck. Are we on the are we on the verge of seeing something brand new? This was on Valentine's Day this year. Hi, Phil Swift here for Flex Paste. Oh, Phil. The incredible rubberized paste. Right out of the tub, Flex Paste is super thick. It clings oh, to the surface. Oh, damn. Just like you, Phil. Fucking thick. Damn, boy. Top of the morning to you, Phil. Oh, Phil. Phil, what are you doing? You mad, man? It instantly fills gaps and holes. Flex. <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> Of course it does. Any paste would have done that. <laughs> so does plaster, Phil. Or drywall. Anything like that. Let Tell me why flex paste is the new hip happening technology. Penetrates deep into hard to reach areas. You can oh, spread God. it, shape it. I don't know if I like hearing the fact that Phil Swift is saying that it can penetrate any area and you can spread it. Also, it's a bad that I really want to eat it. spread it, shape it. To take on just about any form. I Loose really want to eat it. Based on wood, metal, all types of surfaces. And once it dries, it turns to this a strong, flexible rubber. It expands and <laughs> contracts. It turns into this a big, giant condom. Flex paste is tough. Oh, stuff. Phil, no. Phil, stop. Somebody stop it. He's a madman. Phil. <laughs> now 
Now that's a lot of damage. Ah, he did it. He said it. He did the meme. That's why we're here. It's the only reason we watch these videos is to see Phil meme on himself. Fucking love it. What a baller. You can create a watertight seal. Flex Paint's rubberized coating is UV, chemical, and mildew resistant. In extreme heat, driving rain, or freezing cold, Flex Paint... Okay, come on now, Phil. You didn't actually put it through those weather conditions. That's just CGI. I've seen some Marvel movies. I know what that looks like. Flex Paste is perfect for projects, crafts, and hobbies. That's cool. Shape it, mold it, or paint it any color. With Flex Damn. Paste, you can create just about anything you can imagine. Is that tiny train made out of Flex Paste? I like this, though. I like that they're not just trying to sell it to the people who are like, Hey, fix your boat that you sawed in half. Fix the barrel that you chainsawed. No. Build arts and crafts with your kids. And when insects or rodents are getting into your home, use flex paste to seal up large holes. Oh to no! Keep those oh no! Out. That's really sad. Won't dissolve or wash away. And it even works underwater. Burn him! Burn him at the stake! That's pure witchcraft. Burn him. Burn Phil Swift. He'd probably just coat himself in like flex paste though and he'd be fine. And once flex paste dries, it turns into a strong flexible rubber. Storms and floods can destroy Wait, your- Wait, you said it sticks to any surface. If I stick it to the surface, how can I take it off then to show that it's a strong flexible rubber? I don't know, my, my sniffer is smelling some bullshit, Phil. Oh, Phil, what are you gonna do to, to the chickens? To show you the power of flex paste. You're not gonna kill a chicken, are you? I took this chicken wire! Woo! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> His fucking face! I took this chicken wire! Woo! I think Phil's been left inside with flex paste for a little too long. I think the fumes are starting to go to his head. Oh, it's okay though, because no chickens were harmed during the making of this commercial. Whew. Is Phil okay though? Was he harmed? Bent, shaped, and molded it, then covered it. Oh with my god, he's making another paste. boat! and created the world's first flex paste rubber boat. Not only does flex paste seal up Bill! every hole in the chicken wire, but it creates a strong watertight what barrier a fucking lunatic. that bends and stays flexible. And the inside is completely dry. Oh my God, Phil. <laughs> Phil, stop smelling the flex paste. I thought for a second there we were getting like the prequel to flex tape. Or he sawed the boat in half and then he put it back together. Now you can make a boat out of flex paste, saw it in half, and put it back together with flex tape. I think that the Phil Swift cinematic universe is even more dense and rich than Marvel at this point. I absolutely love Phil. There is no greater salesman in the history of infomercials than Phil Swift. He li he knows the product, he has a hand in making it, he knows how to sell it, and he's able to shit post and meme all day long. My god, that's amazing. And we saw it here, first, on the Jacksepticeye Variety Channel at Jacksepticeye's Funniest Home Videos. Actually, 1.9 million people saw it first on Flex Seal, but just because I lied doesn't mean it's not true. Stop drinking milk, Anthony! Literally straight up milk. You don't even put anything in it. You don't even put anything in it. You or, don't even put strawberry stuff or chocolate stuff I don't or have anything. Strawberry stuff or chocolate stuff because I would. Then go buy some. Stop drinking normal <laughs> milk. Are you a are you a criminal? <laughs> What's the deal with milk? When I was growing up, I, everyone drank milk straight with dinner. I used to love drinking milk. I'd, I'd- Yeah, like that. There you go. I don't even care what this is from. I don't even care what's going on in this clip. That got a great whole chuckle out of me. Yeah, we can probably play slot bitches after this. Hey, slot fun bitches. house! There are a bunch of topless women now. Again, it's art. Is it? Yeah, you wouldn't blur the Mona Lisa. Mona Lisa's not naked. She should be. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you haven't seen the rest of the picture. You don't know what Mona Lisa's wearing down there. Also, what game did it show? Slot bitches. Let's start a topless game. I also love these uh, beautiful tags or titles or genres or whatever they are. There's some real shit on the internet. Hi, Billy Beats here from the Big Day Slot Bitches. Hi, Billy Beats here from the Big Day Slot Bitches. Holy shit, my mind can't keep up. Stop! Ah! Ten times.
times as powerful. <laughs> What a great way to end it off. So he just says the exact same thing every time. I Billy Mays are coming. Amazing. See, I feel like Phil Swift is the new Billy Mays. We had Vince for a while. Vince wasn't really up to scratch. Vince kind of like rose high but fell hard. Billy Mays, legend in the scene. Phil Swift, a new classic. Also, this really reminds me of the time somebody put all my top of the mornings together. Top of the mornings, you ladies. My name is Jack Zep, the guy in. I am wearing the exact same outfit in both of these videos. You know why? Because I probably recorded them both on the same day. And another one! And another one! My god, I recorded so many videos on that one day, or two days, where I had the exact same outfit. People always come to me being like, Jack, you know you're wearing the same outfit as yesterday? It's like, yeah. I upload a lot of videos. I'm not going to change my shirt for every single one of them. <laughs> oh! There you go. <laughs> that is fucking horrific. And beautiful all at the same time. See? I'm consistent. I have the same thing every time. Top of the morning to you laddies! Like clockwork. All right, that's gonna do it for this episode of Jack Guys videos, home videos. That one was pure chaos. There was no structure to this video at all. And you know what? Sometimes that's fine. Cause laughter 